This situation, however, has me so bothered, so pissed off. Watching the video yesterday, I don't give a rat's behind what transpired prior to this cop holding this man down. It does not matter simply because the fact of what I saw was this man was fully detained and no longer struggling. He was handcuffed, belly down on the freaking ground and yelling, well not yelling, I'm sorry, barely breathing, right? Pleading for his life that he couldn't breathe. This person was no longer a threat. I don't care that he got fired. Who cares that these police officers got fired? I want the gosh darn trial to start because this was straight up, no questions asked, murder. This was murder. This was a lynching of sorts. Whether it was racially motivated or not, I don't care. I don't care if the man was black, if he was Oriental, if he was Hispanic, or he was another white man. What happened was straight up murder. Now, with that said, I am not going to detract from the fact that this was a black man. I don't get the racism thing. So I have been one of the people that have been like, no, this can't be racially motivated. You know, and I hear the black community with, you know, the Black Lives Matter and all this stuff. And I hear them and saying there's so much racism going on. And for people like me that don't have a grid for racism, I don't see it because I don't relate to it. So first of all, forgive me for not having that lens. Um, I don't ever want to have that lens, um, but I don't also want to detract from my brothers and sisters that are going through hell. Um, and if that is the case, it is going to take every freaking white American to stand up and make a difference, to stand up and say, oh, hell no, not in my country, not on my watch, not in my lifetime, this is gonna stop. If this is actually what's going on, that we have black Americans that are literally afraid of law enforcement because this kind of crap is going on, it's not the black Americans responsibility to stand up and try and change that. If it is rooted in racism, if it is rooted in any kind of white supremacist crap, it is our job to stand up. I will tell you that I have been one that's like, okay, so when there's a, a Muslim terrorist attack, the Muslims need to stand up and reject those people out of their religion, right? The, the peaceful, loving, wonderful Muslims need to go, oh, well, hell no, you're not Muslim. Get the hell out. I'm saying the same thing for white people. We need to stand up and look at whoever this is, whether it's law enforcement, whether it's whatever organization of white people and say, oh, hell no, you are not American. Oh, hell no, you don't embody what we stand for. And oh, hell no, you're not welcome in this country as far as I'm concerned. I don't know how to fix this problem other than every white American using their peer pressure and saying, uh-uh, this is not okay. It is long past time to stop it. America is supposed to be a city on a hill. America is supposed to be a light to the rest of the world. And I tell you what, where the hell's the light? Where's the light? This has to stop. Love you guys.